if you've got the latest update for the software for Apple's iPhone or iPads to iOS 12 there's just a, a few features that are quite new one in particular I want to show you that will be very useful for when you're typing text and want to make changes so if we take for example if I open the notes app here okay now I've typed some gobbledygook up there let me just type some more you can see there look okay now if I want to make changes ordinarily you're going to have to do this aren't you I don't know if you know that if you press and hold along there it's a little bit fiddly but there's a new way you can do now so the cursor's at the end there as you can see now as I'm typing if I now press and hold the space bar you can see the keyboard has gone blank and you'll see the cursor at the top quite large up here moving along as I move my finger along so the keyboard is just like a blank, blank sheet of paper just ignore the shapes of the, the squares but you can see there I can uh, manoeuvre that wherever I stop it stays locked and then you can make adjustments whatever you want so if we go back to the end I'll show you again so I'm typing away press and hold the space bar and take it wherever you want up or down across left and right and wherever you stop that's where it'll stay do your adjustments and then whatever you want to do press the space bar take it back to the end if you want that's it so that's very useful I think you can do it right back to um, iPhone 5S and the iPads up to, I think it's iPad Pro. Anyway, I hope that's very useful to you for when you're doing any texts, um, documents or anything. I found it very useful already. So anyway, if you like the video, give us a thumbs up. If you don't, give us a thumbs down. Okay, thank you. Bye-bye.